Okay, so, 8 of 11 clues. There's 3 more clues somewhere. How do I get them? Cops, gotta stick together. Wow, you're very useful. You're real useful to this sophistication, you asshole. Man, I can't do anything anymore with him. Where could these other three clues be? This here? Aha! Autopsy report. Cause of death, ligature strangulation. Trauma to neck and larynx via garroting. Or, or, I don't know if it's called garroting or garroting. I don't know how to, how to pronounce that word. A uh, severe abrasions to the wrists and ankles, most likely the result of being bound by hemp rope, consistent with all the other bell murder or bell killer murders. All right, who the hell just walked in? This guy? No, who walked in? This guy. Here we go. What would we like to make him remember what he should be doing? Person's flyer. Yep, that's what's right next to it. Gotta find that info about the missing tenant. Okay. Peak. All right, Cassandra Foster, 42, resident of the Regal Apartments. Professional psychic medium and criminal profiler. Occasional consultant for the Salem Police Department. Last seen by neighbors two weeks ago. No criminal record. All right, here's our answer. Joyce, 15 years old. Her legal guardian is her mother, Cassandra Foster. Oh, she's in custody. What? That's what I meant to push. Damn it. That's what I was trying to get. Alright, all 11 clues found. Conclude the investigation. I think I've learned all I can here. I better go find that witness. Find the witness in the holding cell. So they just, they literally just arrested her. <laughs> well, good thing I know where the holding cell is. here. Right? Oh no, this is forensics. Fuck, I went the wrong way. Interrogation rooms. The other, the other side. This way. Here we go. This way. There she is. Each one of these keys is a felony. Each one. You get that, right? Spit his face. No. Dirty copper. Right, it's your funeral. Sit tight. Relax. You're going to be here for a while. Fuck. All right, look. Look, I might be able to help you. Is your mom's book from the Bell Killer case here? Yes. And it would probably help me find my mom. But as I told you before, you're dead. How can you possibly help me? I know this place better than you. Now, who did your mom work with here? Who? I don't know. She just called him Bastard. <laughs> you know, we know who. Baxter, right. yeah? His office was on the second floor. You stick with me, I'll get you there. Let's go. Go where? They're watching. Oh, shit. Not for long. Yeah, never mind. Watch this shit. Poltergeist that shit. Gotta distract them, I bet. Follow yep. my lead. I'll get you past these cops and to the door on the other side. Piece of cake. Yeah. 
Last time you got caught, Magellan. Stay low, or they'll see you. Hope this night stays quiet. Coffee maker squirting everywhere. <laughs> oh, a fax nightmare. These are some dumb cops. Uh. Stay low, but go faster than that. Uh. Here we go. Nice job, kid. We're almost there. You don't need a cheerleader. Hey, I got us this far, didn't I? You got yourself killed, Mr. Bullet Holes. Uh, 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 hey, kid. I hate these things. Uh, I, I can't get across there. You're going to have to help me. Can't you just fly over it? Fly? No. I'm a ghost, not a plane, all right? And look, you need me to tell you which office is his. Duh. Don't read any of my thoughts. Or, or think anything. Ah, oh, I got a possessor, right? Yep. This doesn't make sense. There we go. Okay, man. Get out. Aha. Uh -huh. I got this. Okay, time to distract more cops. Dumb and dumber here. What the? Thought Salem PD would be a safe job. Crap, how do I get this guy to move? Uh don't want to get involved in this homicide stuff. Why doesn't he ever talk? What the fuck? They're just standing there staring at each other, not talking. <laughs> I do here. Time to move, girl. There we go. Distracted him. Good. <sighs> it's close. Where is everybody? Detectives usually work the day shift. Okay, but which office is Baxter's? It's in the back hallway to the right. Okay. Uh. Alright, I already did all this stuff, which is kind of funny that I came and did it by myself before I, before I came, uh, you know, where I had to come over here now. Okay. Are you trying to get caught? You're about as stealthy as a tornado. Ugh, the desk was like that when we got here. Yeah, I know. How many places can you hide a book in one tiny little room? Who knows? Huh. Whoa. What is making those sounds? Mugshot.
Yep, I thought Rex suppressed this. Looks like someone was hiding your real rap sheet. Now I have proof. Huh. He never used that blackmail file against me. Sure, take your time. No rush, I'm sure that book will find itself. All right, just calm down a second here. Cops don't hide things in plain sight. I just need to figure this out. Need to find a witness mother's journal. Okay. <laughs> 